Welcome to the students of class 10, A, B and C, those who have taken commercial studies. Students, today we are going to learn chapter 1, Stakeholders in Commercial Organizations. Let us know the reduced syllabus prescribed by the council. In chapter 1, we are going to learn the meaning of stakeholders, meaning and different types of internal and external stakeholders, differences between internal and external stakeholders, expectations of owners and managers, employees, creditors, suppliers, government, etc. from a commercial organization. First, let us learn the meaning of stakeholders. Stakeholders are the individuals, institutions, groups. They have a stake, which means interest in the functioning of a commercial organization. They create a direct or indirect influence in a business enterprise. They are a very important part of a business organization because they provide the necessary resources and the support to business. Example for internal and the external stakeholders. Owners, employees, creditors, trade associations, government, general public are some of the examples of stakeholders. Let us learn who are internal and the external stakeholders. Meaning of internal stakeholders. Owners are shareholders who supply capital and play a key role in running the enterprise and the employees who work as managers, supervisors and various level workers who provide physical efforts and employ their special skills in the job they do are known as internal stakeholders. Meaning of external stakeholders. Stakeholders such as creditors, suppliers, trade associations, government, local communities who have a stake externally are known as external stakeholders. Some of the differences between internal and the external stakeholders. Internal stakeholders are the individuals, groups within the organization, whereas external stakeholders are the outside parties that affect the business activities. Example for internal stakeholders are employers, staff, volunteers, donors example for external stakeholders are customers society government suppliers creditors etc internal stakeholders serve the organization and the influence is internal external stakeholders are influenced by the organization's work and their role is external Internal stakeholders have direct influence, whereas external stakeholders have indirect influence with the business organization. Expectations of stakeholders. Let us learn the expectations of some of the internal stakeholders. Employers. Employers expect the following from a business organization. They expect safety of capital invested, a fair and a regular return on capital, goodwill of the organization. Employees who are in an internal to a business expect security of job and a safe working condition. They expect 
a fair remuneration as a salary or wages. They too expect a quick and fair redressal of grievances. Of course, they expect a business organization to provide protection of trade union rights. Suppliers who are one of the external stakeholders expect a fair and a timely payment from a business organization. They expect a regular order from business enterprises and also they expect a healthy business relation. Government, which is one of the important external stakeholders, expect from a business organization to make a regular payment of taxes, to observe the laws and the rules of the nation, and to provide cooperation with the government in economical and social development of the country. That's all students from me. This is the end of the chapter one. Students, if you have doubts, you are free to approach me. Use the WhatsApp group and post your doubts so that I will be able to help you out. Thank you students for spending time with me. Let us meet in the next class. Thank you once again.